Hello, Jonathan Landeros for Kativ Technologies, and in this week's video, I'm going to show how you can use the Alt Drag method to quickly create insert constraints. Here, I have some bolts that I wish to place into holes using the insert constraint. Now, I could activate the constraint tool and place each one of these bolts one at a time, making sure to hit apply between each bolt. Even though that goes by pretty quickly, it'd be nice if there was an easier way. And in fact, there is. Alternately, I can hold down the Alt constraint and click under the head of the bolt on the circular edge where it's going to insert and drag it over to its corresponding hole. Once I let go of the mouse, it will go ahead and create the insert constraint. And this is a much quicker way of doing it than actually going through and activating the constraint tool and clicking the buttons each and every time. So when I have a lot of constraints I need to place, I can very quickly do that with the alt drag method. And all I have to do is go through and do that for any fastener that I have. So go ahead and give this one a try. When you have a lot of constraints that you need to place, this can be a quick way of doing this. And also, check at the link below for a link to the wiki help talking about how you can do this for other constraints as well. Personally, I like to use this for the insert constraint. But that's not the only place that it's helpful, so be sure to check out that wiki help. That's it for this quick tip, and thanks for taking the time to watch.